hair on. So she watch you. Dang I'm up. So I was playing this through midnight. And it's morning now. It's the first thing I do. I haven't even eaten breakfast. But first of all, I just wanted to do that. In the original game, it would have done the na 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 in the the uh, opening screen. Well, not, not the opening sequence, but this screen, the, me the menu. Okay. Anyway, I'm sorry for the blunder of Englishing. Let's let's talk to Nagito because he's got crap up his sleeve. You, what are you doing here? <laughs> you sure ask weird questions. That's not. I mean, it. you guys all have business with me, right? Huh? Well, Shaki invited me to the lobby. She said she had something important she wanted to talk to me about. Everyone put her up to that, right? He's already found out about her plan. Well, using Chiaki was a, probably a bad idea because she would be like the least likely to go out to lure somebody like that. <laughs> Looks like that's a bingo, huh? <laughs> but it's good timing. I have some business with you too. You do? Everyone's already at the lobby. That saves me a lot of trouble. And I want you to come to the lobby too, even though you're not directly involved with the plan. You even know that? I see. Just as I thought. You were left out, huh? But that's understandable, because you're just a reserved course student. Right. Since you're the only one who isn't an ultimate, you've basically been left out from the start. Now, now. I'm only joking. Don't make such a scary face. Your joke isn't funny. You shouldn't take me so seriously. See? Oh well. Anyway, let's hurry over to the lobby. I don't know the details of your plan, so I'm actually looking forward to it. I wonder what you guys are going to do to me. <laughs> when we first arrived at this island, we were friends who explored this place together. So let's go already. Fine. Let's go. Yep. Yeah. I don't know what he's thinking, but as long as we capture him, we'll have the advantage. I won't let him do as he pleases anymore. Boy. Um, I don't know what you guys are planning, but like I said, I also need to talk to you guys about something. <laughs> Isn't that a strange coincidence? It's like there's something we both need to tell each other. I won't let him do as he pleases anymore. Alright guys, we've been found out. But it's okay. Chaki has summoned Nagito, and the plan has already started. Fuyuhiko and Akane should be waiting inside for Nagito. Jeez. What happened, Ajime? What are you so nervous about? I'm not nervous. <laughs> You're a terrible actor. Oh well. If you're going to slow down like that, I'll go inside first. As I hesitated in, fr in front of the door, Nagito walked past me and entered the hotel lobby. And that's when it happened. Oh. Alright. I got him. Um, what are you doing? Don't judge us for this, but we're gonna tie you up. <laughs> tie me up? There's no use struggling! But I'm not struggling. Huh? What, what the hell? You're being strangely cooperative. Who cares? Just tie him up before it's too late! You guys are really disappointing. How long are you going to continue behaving so short-sightedly? You gotta look at the big picture, you know? Huh? What are you talking about? It's fine if you don't understand. You can just see the end without knowing. Now then, let's begin! The beginning of the end of Jabberwock Island! And that's when it happened. Out of the corner of my eye, I saw a bright light. The fudge? The air shook. An explosion of darkness overtook me and I was unable to see anything. I probably lost consciousness. Shortly after the impact, I managed to open my eyes slightly. The fudge? What's going on? Are the words that left my mouth, but they vanished before they ever reached my ears. They were drowned out by the sound of terrifying laughter. I looked up and saw the source of that laughter. <laughs> it's a me, 
amazing! These amazing fireworks surely befit the beginning of the end! It's over. This is the end. The killings are done for good. Scapegoating the weak in the name of justice, while fearing when the others will stab you in the back. This game of self-righteous hypocrisy ends now! And to do that, I will destroy Jabberwock Island! What do you mean? That was just a little demonstration. That's why it's the beginning of the game. The actual bomb I'm going to use isn't nearly as weak. A actual bomb? I've set up a large number of bombs in a certain area of the island. If all those bombs explode, the force will be enough to wipe out this entire island. So I wonder if what Nagito is doing is really just trying to draw out the traitor, because if he if he does this in a manner that is, I guess, very secretive. Maybe his aim is to try to get somebody to reveal their knowledge of future Foundation. Because maybe what he's doing is something that only a future Foundation member would know about. I don't know. But it'd be kind of clever if that was the case. What the hell are you saying? If you do that, of course, I doubt we'll walk away from this unharmed. But there's no other way. The actor is expected to leave the stage during the finale. Is this bastard serious? Okay, so Cosby 2 did not die, but there's another similarity. Somebody getting blown up on in the fifth chapter. Nagito, please stop! Uh, are you crazy or something? No, that's not it. I'm not the crazy one here. The one who's really crazy is... My, my, this guy. Emergency! I'm totally shocked! Emergency! Seriously, I'm totally shocked! That's all I can say about this turn of events. <laughs> the bombs I set are timed. They're set to go off in two days at noon. I prepared so many powerful bombs that the one that just exploded doesn't even compare. According to my calculations, they're powerful enough to blow up an entire island. Which means in two days at noon, this island is destined to sink into the sea. Are you serious? Do you really think I'd go this far for a joke? You. Where? Where did you set him up? <laughs> I can't tell you. How about it? It'd be easy to leave you on your own, but it just wouldn't be fair if I did that. So how about this? If the traitor comes forward and reveals their identity to me, I'll tell them where I hid the bombs. Huh? Uh, what, what? what in the world is going on? Is everyone alright? Come on, come on, don't get in the way. Nagito was in the middle of weeding out the traitor. N Nagito? What are you planning to do? Do I really have to say it? it? It's no use. I mean, the traitor shouldn't be able to reveal their identity on their own. Why? Hmm? What does that mean? Do I really have to say it? Is it because they're dead? Or... My, my. You guys are totally eyeing each other and letting sparks fly. I'm getting all hot and bothered. D don't just stand there. Why don't you stop him? Huh? Stop him? Why do I have to stop him? The rules, remember? The same blacken can only kill a maximum of two people. If he blows up at the entire island, th that's going to kill way more than just two people. Hmm. I see. You sure have a good memory. Like you said, any student breaks that rule, I have to punish them severely. But if they're dead... Right. But that's only when someone breaks that rule, right? You can't punish someone for breaking your rule before they've broken it, right? That's right! Yep! Saying you're gonna break the rules isn't against the rules! Too bad! So right now, there's no way I can punish this! What the heck? You're so Punishment always stinky. happens afterward, not before. That's just the, the rules of society, right? Hey. But even so, there's no need to worry about that in the first place. As long as the traitor comes forward, this can all be resolved peacefully. This is exciting! It'll all be fine. I'm pretty sure everything will work out in the end. After all the time we've spent together, I believe in you guys. And more than anything, I believe in my ultimate luck. So, it's definitely going to be alright. After he said that, Nagito walked away. He just... walked away. I couldn't even stop him. I felt... afraid of Nagito. The madness emanating from Nagito's body was seeping into my bones. 
I never expected him to go this far. <laughs> Nagito is so reliable. I don't have to do anything because he's shaking things up. <sighs> that beats hard. I'll never forget him. Forgive him. Damn it! Is he effing serious about these bombs? Hey, hey! As long as the traitor comes forward, he'll say where the bombs are. Right? Is that his goal? Damn it! Then I'm begging you guys. It doesn't matter who does it. Someone just has to come forward. Hey, I'm begging you guys. No matter how long we waited, no one was willing to come forward. When Nagito said yesterday, I'll weed out the traitor even if it costs me my life. I finally understand what he meant. Nagito took this entire island hostage and created a situation where the traitor has to come forward. That is Nagito's goal. But what is he planning to do if the traitor doesn't come forward? Is he really going to blow up this entire island? Of course! My motto is to do a good deed every day. When I was at a bar and shouted, Can I get a Sam? The female bartender happily answered, Sure thing. It makes me so happy when someone else is this happy. Doing a good deed every day is awesome. But inside, that woman probably thought I was a loser for sitting alone at a cheap bar in the middle of the night. Darn it, I can't keep up with this crap. Hey, sweet cheeks, give me another Sam. Huh? Not a Sam Adams. I'm obviously talking about a raw salmon. And here's some good news for you. I have imbued the sense or the smell of vanilla into the Monokuma plushies. It's effective aromatherapy, and it'll definitely calm everyone's nerves if they're agitated. <laughs> Available in your future. <laughs> That's it for Monokuma Shopping Corner. Vanilla smelling plushie. Mm. Ahem! Hope's good morning, everyone. Now then, let's show. I've been resting since the explosion yesterday, but my body still hurts. A dull, metallic sound is ringing in my ears, and the back of my head feels hot. I can't think straight. I can't afford to spend the whole day resting. I immediately left my cottage. Oof, man. Hey, Kaz. So how about yesterday? Hey, it's you, right? You're the traitor, aren't you? What the heck are you saying? Come on, just admit it already. If you don't, we're all gonna die. I'm not the traitor. Damn it. I'm begging you. It doesn't matter who admits it. Just save me. Get a hold of yourself, Kazuichi. Complaining won't change anything, okay? Shut up, I know shut that. Up. What else can we do? We need to think about that with the others. So let's hurry over to the restaurant. Damn it. Uh, darn it. Hmm. I don't know. It's increasingly pointing towards Chiaki, I have to say. Yo. No, it's you. You're covered in sweat. Huh. I was looking for Nagito. This traitor stuff bugs the crap out of me. I won't we just have to you. beat him up and make him tell us where the bombs are. But I can't find him anywhere. Is he hiding or something? Damn it. I'm starting to get hungry. Maybe I should go back to the restaurant. It kind of looks pretty frustrated. I guess that makes sense. After what happened yesterday. Darn it. What's going to happen to us now? Uh. Let's see if it scared the crap out of my pet. Okay, no dookies. So it didn't scare the crap out of us. Alright, anybody else? Nah. Oh god, this place is going to be just wrecked. Is Chaka going to be able to play her game? Oh, this is so sad. Look at this. She's quietly staring at the arcade machine with sad eyes. Good morning, Hajime. Did this arcade machine break? Aww. It was too close to the explosion. I guess it couldn't take it. Man, this arcade machine was really popular. And it was so tough that even an elephant couldn't damage it. But if it's broken, I can't do anything about it. I guess that's just how it is. You can ask Kazuichi to fix it. Her shoulders are sagging pretty low. Or maybe, maybe she's actually sad about the whole traitor situation. And the arcade machine's a cover-up. Yo. Hajime, how you feeling? Not good, but not so bad that I can't move. <laughs> then you're okay. I'm not okay at all. My ears are seriously ringing. He was like right by the explosion. 
My eardrum is definitely ruptured. I need to hurry and have a doctor look at it. So, what should we do now? However, what can we do? How troubling. If the trader would just come forward, this problem would be resolved in no time. Nagito, when did you... Is there a, a secret transportation door thing here too? Like from the funhouse? Hey. Good morning. I came to motivate you guys since you're just laying around. Didn't I tell you yesterday that the bombs are set to go off in two days at noon? Well, you've got one day left. Come on, you better hurry. I mean... H hurry? I'm not the one who has to come forward. The trader does, right? Well, that's probably true. But even if this does depend on the traitor, your attitudes aren't admirable at all. Isn't that I mean, right? real hope is when you confront a hopeless situation or difficulty that's standing before you, right? And despite that, you guys are already ready to give up. What does that mean? Or, is this your limit? If so, it makes me laugh to ever think I ever called you symbols of hope. You beat hard. You better knock it off. Now, now. Keep your shirt on. I took the time to come bring you guys a valuable hint. Wouldn't it be bad if I changed my mind? Huh? Did you just say hint? Um, it's best if we hurry and get the hint. I think. Akane looks like she's ready to tackle him. Hey, hey. hey it's okay if I punch him, right? 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 Calm down, Akane. You might feel better after punching Nagito, but if we can't find the bombs, well, then I'll just beat the crap out of him after we find the bombs. Damn it. Nagito's holding all the cards here. You serious? He said hint just now, right? Right? Let's hurry up and find out what that is. Um. For now, we should learn what the hint is. If so, we can find the bombs instead of searching for a traitor who does not even exist. Nagito, what's your hint? I'm glad. Oh, you finally have hope. That makes me happy. Hey! Who, who freaking cares about that? Hurry up and tell us what the hint is. Well... It's about the bomb's hiding place. I hid it somewhere you guys haven't been before. Huh? Somewhere we have not been before? You pissed me off. I don't need any hints. I'll beat you up! Just tell us the answer. If you don't, I'll make you spit it out. Hey, 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 hey! Stop hey, it! Hey. What are we gonna do if he sets off another bomb? Yep. Good judgment. Hey. If you guys have time to pick a fight with me, then you should start searching for the bombs already. Then I'll just crush you to pieces later. Wow. How scary. Hey. Why did you give us a hint? See? Well, if the trader sees their friends working hard, they may feel inclined to come forward, you know? Who cares? Oh. The trader might not even exist. All we need to do is find the dang bombs. Hmm. Let's go. <laughs> Take care. I... Oh, by the way. I'll be waiting here, so if you want to reveal yourself, come see me anytime. What? Mr. or Miss Trader. We left the restaurant as Nagito's muffled laughter trailed behind us. Why? Kazumichi, why did you stop me? Huh? What are you talking about? Yeah. If you hadn't stopped me, I could have crushed Nagito to pieces. Bastard! You're too fired up, dumb, eh? Calm the fudge down, at least. More importantly, let us all head over to the ancient ruin. Hmm. Huh? The ruin? Please listen. Nagito said that the bombs are hidden somewhere we have never seen before. So just as I thought. That is the case. The inside of that ruin is the only place I can think of. Well. No. There was one other place too. It would be Monomi's house. What is it again? That castle at the Mono Park? What's the name? Oh, Nezumi Castle. Huh? Are you talking about that Natsumi Castle? You don't get it at all. He freaking means Nezumi Castle. Then we have those two places to choose from. We won't be able to enter the ancient room without a password. What should we do? Like... A password, huh? I, I'm guessing we still don't have any clues to that. Hey, hey. And that probably goes for Nagito, too. He wouldn't be able to enter the pa without the password either, right? If that's the case, it's hard to think that the bombs were set inside the ancient ruin, right? So we should try going to Nezumi Castle first. Are we screwed? But isn't that dangerous? I mean, what if that was Nagito's trap all along? Monokuma's trap, Monomi's trap, and now Nagito's trap. Dumbass. If we keep worrying about crap like that, we won't get anything done, dumbe. You. You're totally fired up too. Yeah. Hey. Anyway, we should try going there at least. We don't have time to stand around doing nothing. All right. Full speed ahead. 
Alright, we'll tackle the Zooming Castle first. Alrighty. Let's do it up. How's everybody do doing, by the way? I'm doing superb, thank you. It's Saturday morning. It's nice and bright outside. Beautiful weather. I should probably go out. Maybe. I don't know. I could also play this. Alright. Uh, Nezumi Cast. Alright, let's just cut to that. Alright, here we go. Damn it. Hey, don't you think this is definitely a trap? Like, once we go inside the castle? Kaboom! No, I don't think that's gonna happen. Nagito wants us to weed, us, weed out the traitor. Not kill, kill us all at the same time. That's true, but he's crazy, you know. A anyway, we need to keep trying and head over there. Uh, in the end, we still have to go. Anyway, let's go to Nezumi Castle. I don't know why I couldn't be in there, though. I mean, uh, this would make sense, though, Nezumi Castle. Ooh, I'm hungry, dang. I should probably eat breakfast soon. <laughs> hey, 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 check it out! Oh, shoot. The entrance is destroyed. It's been blown to bits, as if someone set off a bomb. I get it. If that's true, it looks like this place was spot on. Then the bombs are inside here. Damn right. That's what it looks like. Mm. Now let's try going inside. But we need to be careful. We need to pay as much attention as we can. You're right. Listen. How can you grip the tr trouser snake if you do not enter its den? Huh? What are you talking about? Well, it's a saying for situations like this, right? When you know there is danger, but you still must face it. Um, what does "grip the trouser snake" mean anyway? Um, this should just be "snake." Trouser hey. snake. Hold it. <laughs> the way she said it is just fine. If you don't correct her, she'll say it as many times as you want. <laughs> you. <laughs> Good job, Hajime. So many of these words just now have been etched into my heart. I see. He's trying to ease everyone's tension. That's pretty considerate of him. Where is it? The grip the trouser snake? Uh, it sounds like, uh, sounds like something else. Mm -hmm. It's not like we know for certain that the bombs are in there. Let's go see what's inside for now. You. What, are you scared? Do you want me to go in first? No, it's fine. I wouldn't mind, though. Are we screwed? But still, he didn't even try to hide the door he destroyed. <laughs> the, don't you think it's a trap? M maybe as soon as we go inside, kaboom! Jeez. Like I said, if you keep worrying about crap like that, you won't get anything done. Just prepare for the worst. <laughs> did Nagito destroy the door? He sure did a thorough job. Alright, let's do it up. Let's go. After forcing a dry swallow, I nervously stepped through the door. And there. Holy crap. Oh my. What is this place? I thought the inside would look more lighthearted than this. Um. The ambiance feels similar to that of a temple or a church. However, is it just me? Or does it seem like there are no bombs to be found here? Well. No, it's not just you. Hmm. If the bombs are strong enough to blow up the entire island, they should be pretty big. But I don't see anything. I don't see a place where they could be hidden either. <gasps> then the bombs aren't here? The bombs aren't here? But even so. I feel like there's something suspicious here, but why? It feels like this place is different somehow. It's, feel, it's feeling. It's the same feeling I felt when I first saw the ancient ruin. Hmm. Since we've never been here before, I thought this place was going to be it for sure. Okay, I got an achievement halfway there, so you can get up to level 100. Wow. Huh? Now you better not be making stuff up just to mess with us. Let me just check for the dookies, since I leveled up. Dookie. Freaking dookie. Alright. Damn right. Hey, looks like something is written on the floor. The floor? Huh? Here, look closely. Oh, there. That is... If the bombs are strong enough to blow up the entire island, they should be rather large. However, no matter what we where we search, we have not found anything like that at all, right? There's no it. bombs here? Then where the heck are they? Perhaps they're buried under the floor, maybe. No, that's not it. There's no sign that the floors were dug up. Mm. Then where are the bombs? If the door was really blasted open, then there's no doubt that Nagito was here. Alright, well, 
before we check the floor, I want to check this out. There's a huge Nordic looking spear on the wall. It looks a little flashy, but I have a strong feeling that the spear isn't just for decoration. Anyway, it's really strange looking. Some kind of cord attached to the end of the handle. Which means this weapon is designed to capture an opponent using the cord as a whip just before you deliver the final blow. So it's like a chain sickle. However, you must be careful. Using a whip as a weapon is quite difficult. You might capture yourself instead of your intended target. That is right. And you might also cause an unexpected fan service moment. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Beautiful fighters who get themselves into immodest situations are in universal demand. Like I said, what are you talking about? <laughs> Alright, let's check this out. To, to all subjects, the password to guide everyone to the future is... <laughs> hmm, what is this? This font doesn't match the ambiance of the castle at all. It's almost like it was intentionally put here. Hey everyone, come check this out. <laughs> What's that? To all subjects. Subjects? Who are they talking about? Is it about us? There's more written below that. What does it mean? The password to guide everyone to the future is... Lies. What the heck is this? We can't even read the most important part. Lies. What does the password to guide everyone to the future mean? Ah, maybe it's that password. Could it be? The password to the access to access that ancient ruin? Guide everyone to the future. Maybe that refers to the Japanese word that is written on the door. Whoa. As expected of Missonia, she only had to read it once to understand what it means. Like. But if we can't read the password, there's nothing we can do. Nice. It is a rather tragic moment. Hey, hey. I wonder who erased this. Huh? Erased? So. I mean, it doesn't feel like it was erased naturally, right? It looks like it was forcibly scratched off. That's the only way I can see it. Even so. But Monami and Monokuma shouldn't have entered this castle because they don't like mice, right? I won't then it was Nagito. You. He's the one who erased the password. For real. Perhaps. Nagito probably discovered the password here and used it to enter the ancient ruin. Then he hid the bombs inside the ancient ruin? So he erased the password so we wouldn't be able to get near the bombs. That actually makes a lot of sense. That's true. He gave us a hint even though he knew we wouldn't be able to use it. Don't tell me. Just so we could shove that reality in our faces. There's no way we can enter that ancient ruin if we don't know the password. In the end, we can't do anything about the bombs unless the traitor comes forward. Did he lure us to this place so we'd be forced to confront that? Forcing us to confront the despair before us. Forcing us to confront how powerless we are. Burn it! That's what Monokuma would do! Uh. Hey, um... Whoever you are, you don't have to reveal yourself to us. Just tell Nagito. If you don't, you'll just end up dying too, you know. You. Hey, who are you saying that to? <laughs> I don't know, I'm just saying it to everyone. Oh. Let's stop. Fighting among ourselves won't help anything. More importantly, let's work hard to find the password to the ancient ruin, or clues that might relate to it. See, she seems very insistent on finding this password. As long as we cooperate and explore all over the island, we might be able to find it, you know? Are you telling us to look everywhere for a password that might not even exist? Hey. Who would leave a password here in the first place, and why? If it wasn't Monokuma or Monomi, then who was it? We can't even answer that, so there's no way we'll be able to find anything. Wait. Then what would you have us do? Just wait until we all die? That is no different than when we were in the fun house. And what did we learn there? We learned not to give up on living, right? Hmm. That, that that Gundam was only the only one who said that. Very well then. I shall look for it on my own. Excuse me. S Sonia, hold on. But Sonia ignored me as I called for her and stormed out of the area. Her shoulders were shaking a little. I'm sure of it. I mean... What, what the heck? Shut up, Darn it! Shut up. Fine then. You want to look for it? Well, fine. Hey! hey. Kazuichi left the Nezumi castle and walked into the opposite direction of Tonya. What the heck are they doing? Now's not the time for infighting. Like... Well, it might be a good idea to work separately. Huh? Why? Huh? I mean, it's easier to move around that way, you know? In case someone wanted to secretly go meet someone. Hey, does that mean... Sorry. Just act like I was thinking out loud and pretend you weren't listening. Damn it. Not again. Man, we're scattered as usual. 
stupid fool. Seriously. Do you think so? Then please help. Huh. Yeah, leave it to me. I've got a secret plan. I, won't I just have to find you. the source of the problem and snap it off. Akane, what's your secret plan? Could it be? I have a bad feeling about the way Akane's acting. I'll run after her. It's best if we keep Akane away from Nagito for now. Far away. Y you're right. I guess I'll leave it to you. Yep. Okay, see you later. Shaki ran after Akane. And from there, I was the only one left. What does this really mean? Who are the subjects that are being referred to? What's the password to guide everyone to the future? I was the last to leave Nesumi Castle, and wandered all over the island searching for clues to the password. But I didn't expect to find anything. And in the end, that's exactly what happened. And so, time passed by with its usual speed. Ahem! Hope speak it is now. Please return to your rooms at Melbourne, sweet. Even after the announcement, I kept searching the island, but I didn't find what we were looking for. After a while, I had forgotten what I was supposed to be looking for in the first place. In the end, after coming up empty-handed, I returned to the hotel. I didn't see anyone else on my way back here, but I also didn't see them while I was exploring either. That's because, even though this island is so vast, our numbers have drastically decreased since we arrived. I can't think of any other reason than that. I should go back. Nagito said time runs out at noon tomorrow. Another day is about to end, which means there's only half a day left. I can't imagine the traitor will be revealed by then, since we don't even know if they really exist. And even if they do, it's possibly forgotten that they're the traitor. All, all this thinking makes me feel like I should do something, but my brain and body were yearning for rest, probably because of all the walking I did today. As I dozed off, horrible, disgusting images began to surface from the back of my mind, one after the other. But before I could focus on the specifics of those images, I slowly sank into the depth of darkness. Hey! I think giving up is really important. If you don't give up on your dreams, they'll come true. That's just irresponsible and lazy encouragement. No matter how much you try without giving up, it's useless in the end. Persistence is just the worst. That's why giving up is so important. But you can't give up if you don't even try. That's, all That's actually the worst of all. Theater. What? Huh. Ahem! Hope speak. Good morning, every Now then, let's show... The scenery this morning is the same as it ever was. I can see the sunlight peeking through the window. I can hear the faint sound of waves crashing on the beach. But the bombs Nagito said are going to destroy all this once time runs out at noon. At the moment, there's nothing about our situation that's changing for the better. Usually I'd go to the restaurant, but what should I do today? As long as I remember what Nagito said. Oh, by the way, I'll be waiting here, so if you want to reveal yourself, come see me anytime. Mr. or Miss Trader. It sounds like he was planning to hang out at the restaurant all day. Wait a minute, he's going to be there all day? Then, if anyone went to the restaurant like they normally do... Bad feeling lingering in my chest grew with each beat of my frantic heart. I immediately ran out of my cottage. I wonder if he's bluffing, though, about the bombs. Oh boy. Um, Good morning, Hajime. I... Um, about yesterday. I may have been somewhat careless with my words. I could not keep myself from snapping at what Kazuichi said, and I acted on my own. Thanks to my actions, everyone ended up going their own separate ways, right? Yeah, but what you said wasn't wrong either. Um, I have not given up yet. I will do my very best to live until the very end. If not, I will not be able to force I will not be able to face Gundam, Nekomaru, or the others who have died. Oh boy.
The moment I set foot inside the restaurant, the worst case scenario is unfolding before me. Playtime's over. Now, where'd you hide the bombs? That hurts, but I'll never tell. If you really want me to spit it out, you should try torturing me or something. Huh? Torture? Maybe you can stab my fingers with that fork over there. Or scoop my eyes out with that spoon. If you're not willing to fill me with despair, there's no way my hope will ever burn. Oh. Kami's hand suddenly wrapped around Nagito's neck, and his face began turning a startling shade of red. Wrong with me? Just die already! The clenched hands kept squeezing even tighter, as if she was trying to snap his neck instead of just strangling him. Hey, hey. What are you doing? Akane! Hey, are you alright? Isn't he seriously gonna die? But she was too overcome by rage to acknowledge us. Huh? Ooh. Calm down, okay? You wouldn't do something like that, right? You're not the kind of person who would hurt someone. Right? See, it's alright. Yep, no problem. Sorry, I'm awake now. That's weird. What was I doing anyway? Hey, hey. Th that's what I want to ask. Don't tell me you were actually thinking about killing him. And that's when it happened. The quarter of my eye, I saw him slowly stand up. Thanks. Thank you, Akane. I got to see my dead dog again. I haven't seen him in ages. Huh? Serves you right. You probably pissed off Akane in the first place. Wow. Hmm. I didn't mean to do that though. Anyway, thank you for saving me. Looks like I owe you one. Then... If you sincerely mean that, please tell us the password to enter the ancient ruin. Huh? The password? To the ancient ruin? What are you going to do with that? Don't play dumb. You... You've hidden the bombs inside the ruin, right? You're right. Yep, I did. <laughs> Until yesterday. Huh? Hey, hey. Until yesterday? Hey! Well, what the heck does that mean? Why do you have to go and make things so complicated? Over here, Avril Lavigne. Then, I assume correctly, he definitely hid the bombs inside the ancient ruins. However, what exactly does he mean by "until yesterday"? Damn it! That beach heart. Did he actually move the bomb somewhere else? Thanks, Chiaki, for stopping Akane. Nope. No, I didn't do anything. Akane isn't the sort of person who could seriously do something like that in the first place. Is that so? I think. But more importantly, it might be better if we listen to what Nagito has to say. I think. Sorry. Seriously, I messed up. I made you freak out. It's like I wasn't myself anymore. I didn't even realize what I was doing. I'm surprised at myself. Hey Nagito, what do you mean by until yesterday? Well, there wasn't anything important inside the ancient ruin. Just some familiar scenery. Familiar scenery? Jeez. I got bored of it. Also, I hid them in there. If I hid them in there, it would be completely meaningless. <sighs> so even if you hadn't managed to learn the password to the ancient ruin, it has no meaning anymore. Now that I've moved the bomb somewhere else. Hey, hey. But they were inside that ancient ruin, right? I'm glad. Anyway, I'm guess I guess it was right for me to move them. They were about to be found before the traitor confessed. Well, it's not like it really matters. In fact, that might be better. Amazing. To make hope shine even brighter. Bastard. Stop talking crazy and tell us where you moved the bombs already. <laughs> Looks like you're in a hurry. Well, that's understandable. After all, time runs out today. Hey. Then let's begin the final battle. The final battle between the traitor and everyone else. <laughs> the final battle between hope and despair. The place I hid the bombs this time is... A place you've all visited at least once. That's it. That's too broad. See? It shouldn't be that hard if you guys split up. For now, why, you, why don't you guys search everywhere as fast as you can? As long as everyone cooperates, it should be easy to find out where the bombs are. What the heck? This is exciting. It's going to be fine. I'm pretty sure everything will work out in the end. After all, there's no way hope can lose. <laughs> Absolute hope that can break through any despair can never lose in a place like this. I... And not only that, I believe in you all. I believe in the time we spent together. And more than anything, I believe in my ultimate luck. 
so it's going to be fine. As long as you believe and hope with all your hearts, the path should open. With that, Nagito walked away and left us with a sinister mixed message. Damn it! Why does he still have to be alive? Dumbass! Now's not the time to complain about stuff like that. Oh. Besides, we don't have time to fight among ourselves. You are right. We must hurry and search for the bombs. We should still have time to stop them. I mean... But based on all the places we've searched, I don't know where we should look. Shut the the hell only up. thing we can do is split up and cover as much ground as we can. There are exactly six of us. Each person should be in charge of searching an island. Damn it. Then leave this island to me. I already have the layout of this island in my head. Hmm. If Akane is the first island, I'll do the second one. <laughs> Miss Sony should get the smallest island. Are you okay with searching these, the central island? Huh? But, but... Anyway. You're probably not not good at covering ground anyway, right? It's fine. You can search the central island. Chiaki, you search the third island with the hospital. Hajime, you search the amusement park island. And I'll handle the final island. Alright, let's do this. Let's hurry up and find those bombs so we can take care of Nagito once and for all. We stormed out of the restaurant and immediately left to search for the bombs. We didn't have time to even think about who the traitor is. But it's ironic. Nagito is the reason we're all splitting up, but the reason we're all cooperating is because of Nagito, too. It's pretty darn ironic. I'm in charge of searching the fourth island. I should search every nook and cranny. According to Nagito, the bombs have enough power to easily wipe out this entire island. Then it's probably not very small. I'll definitely find it. Alright, I think I, I have an idea where it could be. Um, yeah, let's just look there first. Before I end the gameplay. Yep. Yeah, oh, look at that. Doors open. Booyah. Alright, so I'm gonna actually end it right there, guys. Hope you guys have been enjoying this. Uh wow. Um so yeah, like this video if you liked it, dislike it, disliked it. And as always, peace!